Hi YouTube, so today I'm coming just to do a small little review about this flat um, curling iron here <clears throat> and to show you guys how easy this hair from the Glamour House of Hair curls. Um, tomorrow I am going to an event. It is the ABS Chicago and so uh, America's Beauty Show I believe is the name of it and I'm going to be volunteering over there so I want my hair curled up. I have to be there pretty early so I'm not going to get up in the morning. So I guess what I can do is show you guys how I curl it tonight <clears throat> and then do a small little clip in the morning as to how well it holds up. Again, this is the Glamour House of Hair Smooth Seduction. And um, <clears throat> yeah, so the flat, the curling iron is heating up right now. And I'm not going to flat iron or curl any of my hair. I'm going to put rollers in my hair. Because I'm trying to minimize the amount of heat. I did wash the hair again because my real hair needed some tender loving care. I have these little pieces right up here. All you beauticians out there. Is that breakage or is that new growth or just baby hairs? Am I only noticing it because my hair is up I don't know somebody tell me see that anyway so yeah I'm not gonna put any heat on my real hair and I wish I had a clip but I just have to do it like that so back to the curling irons the curling irons came from Sally's Beauty Supply and they were on sale for about 20 bucks I believe and they are called the Power IQ. You guys have seen these before. Yeah, Power IQ. And this might be an inch and a half barrel. I don't know, they go up to 450 degrees. And they have a knob so it can be adjusted. And then on this side, it has the on off switch. And yeah, so let's get started with the curling of the hair. They heat up pretty fast because I just plugged them in. So the way I'm going to curl this is nothing different from what you have seen before. I'm going to do it away from my hair. Uh, my face. And probably won't re record all this. Just a few in the front and then show you guys the end. And then come back tomorrow and show you how well it holds the curl. So that was like a few seconds. And this is the curl I get. Really pretty. Really cute. Do one more. Because you know, I don't want to see somebody curling their hair, I'm sure. And I don't know how to fast forward my camera yet. Well, you know, when I edit, I don't know how to do that. But I do have a mini testimony. So I went to the jewels to get a new memory card. That's one reason why I have not been recording videos late. Because my memory card was full and I didn't want to erase anything off the one I had. And I knew I didn't want to pay an arm and a leg for a memory card. So I get the memory card. I go up to the front to cash out. And the girl said, I have not found the item was saying zero dollars. I was like, oh, it's free. And she just looked or whatever. And she kept typing it in and nothing was coming in. I was like, three dollars, three dollars. She gave it to me for three dollars. So I got a four gig uh, Duracell memory card for three dollars. That's a testimony to me. That's a blessing because I showed him want to pay ten dollars for it. Which is how much it was, but you know whatever so yeah these are the curls this is what I'm going for so I'm gonna finish my hair and come back and show you the end results and then tomorrow morning I'll show you what it looks like after I slept on them stay tuned okay so I'm back I have curled all the hair up with the um, again the power IQ curling iron I'm just turning that off and these are the curls I did not really brush them out. I just brushed out the top to kind of blend mine up. 
in so it, I wouldn't look too stupid in front of the camera. But anyway, that's my nephew saying it like he don't realize I'm in here. But anyway, so um, this is the back of the hair curls, not combed out. A lot of body, a lot of bounce. And uh, tomorrow, I plan, well, tonight, I'm going to put flexi rods in my hair. Because as you can see, my real hair is not curled or straightened. Well, it is flat iron, but I will not be putting any more heat in it. So I'm going to take the flat, the flexi rods to the hair. And I have not decided as to whether or not I'm going to wear it like this out because I'm not going to have a brush to be able to, you know, fix it. And I don't know what they're going to have me doing tomorrow or if I'm going to like put it up in a ponytail because I did uh, leave enough hair out to do so with uh, my installation. So I will come back with you guys in the morning and show you guys how it turns out along with probably a face of the day for the mark for tomorrow um so yeah stay tuned thanks hi everyone so i'm coming today to show you the final results of me curling my hair and sleeping in it overnight now this is all day hair um today i volunteered with the abs show here in chicago and it was amazing it was very 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 tiring a lot of work but it was worth it um and so uh last night the the beginning part of this video you're gonna see me curling my hair and trying to prepare it or whatever for that so last night what i did was curl it up on these rollers and then the perimeter and my leave out i curled up on these well this morning when i woke up my curls were like extra tight, like a curly afro almost. And so I was like, oh my gosh, I can't go to go looking like that. And my sister was like, girl, this is a hair show rocket. So of course I did not do that because I didn't feel comfortable. So I wore it like this all day in a little ponytail. So tonight I just took the, the rubber band off. I didn't brush it or anything. And this is the results. As you can see, the curls are still in there. It's not too tangled. See that? But I mean, it is curled up pretty tight, so I don't expect it to, you know, not have any tangles. But yeah, so this is the hair. Just wanted to finish that video and show you guys the hair. Now, in a separate video, I will show you my goodies, my goodie bag, because I got a good bag um, for helping out. And I just want to thank everybody from the ABS if you're watching this out there in the internet world uh, for allowing me to volunteer and allow me to help and take part in this. Um, it was a good experience for me. I also got to take a picture with Jessica Simpson's hairstylist. So I will post that picture on my Facebook page and the link will be below. And I also got my lashes done and I got airbrushed. So this is all day airbrush with Ket Foundation. Um, and that was done in the airbrush class that I took with, uh, I believe her name is Jill Glasser for the Makeup First School here in Chicago. So, um, yeah, it was a fun day. Um, I just want to show you my lashes. Let me see. If... <laughs> I know I look stupid. Let me see. If that's a better, a better angle of them. And these are individual clusters, but they are not like um, the strand by strand. They're just individual with uh, just the, like the duo lash adhesive. And when I tell you this lady put these lashes on me in like four or five minutes on both sides, like not five minutes each eye, but like five minutes period on the stage. She was like putting two on at a time. I was like, where do you stay? Can you teach me what you know, please? But anyway, let me go because Colin's crying now and I don't want that in my video. So um, stay tuned because I will be doing a haul of the things that I got at the ABS show. Thanks. Bye.